Hi guys, my name is Christiana Balogun and welcome to the first ever episode of The Plugin, guys. And yes, it's going to be a full series. You ready? Because I am. Joining me today, we have our very first special guest all the way from Nigeria. So stay plugged in. Hi, Majid. Hello. How have you been? Uh, very well, thank you. Hi. I'm okay, I'm okay. It's just nice to see you. Thank you, you look amazing. Though. Thank you. I mean, I was trying to, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, um, you know, is this your first time in London? Uh, yeah, my first time and definitely not going to be my last time in London. Okay, yeah. okay. So how often do you think you, you're going to be coming now? Uh, more often because, um, I think London is going to be like my second home now. Wow. Yeah. You're going to buy a house? Of course, yes. <laughs> of course, yes. All right. Okay. So it's nice to have you on the plugin. Thank you. Yeah. And um, I've been looking forward, obviously, to this moment because you're super talented. Mm. I mean, I've listened to your EP like I can't count how many times. Like, I'm still listening to you as we're speaking. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes, um, just I'm gonna say two names, okay? You know, actually, I'll make it three, and I want you to tell me mm -hmm. what's the first thing that comes to mind when I say them about them, okay? Okay, you have to tell me one thing, one word, okay? You know, it's, it's, it's like so sudden, so I'll try my best. Yes, that's the um, point. It's meant to be Sunday. <laughs> you give me shockwaves. Okay, let's do it. All right, to a savage. Beautiful. Ooh, okay. Yes, energy. Like energy, that. energy. I love her energy as well. Yeah. Okay, bun boy. Ooh. African giant. <laughs> Best of his kind. Ooh, that's more than one word though. I see you. Yes. I appreciate that. But I want to know about Majid. Ooh. Oh, God. Hey! You're giving me fire, fire, fire. Woo. Okay, tell me, tell me more. Tell me why you say that. <laughs> you know, um, Majid is a different um, personality in the song. It's a different mm -hmm. um, person. Uh, and um, yeah, it's a, it's a demigod. It's a musical genius, yeah. Okay. You know what? I can actually relate as to why you say that because your vibe, the way you sort of like, talk to your audience, yeah. sing to your audience, mm -hmm. it's out of the box. I don't even know if I should place it under that or Tay, yeah, R&B, yeah. so you can't, place it you can't place it anywhere, right? Okay. See, see, I feel you. <laughs> <laughs> so what's, what's your passion? Like, you know, what, what's that thing that drives you, you know, to speak into your audience the way you, you know, speak to your audience? Uh, so, um, so basically, I'm an empath. Right, and um, I like to put myself in people's shoes mm -hmm. and feel exactly what they're feeling mm -hmm. most times. Yeah? yeah, so I try my best as much as possible to tell a story with my music. Right, to tell a story to make it relatable to the general public because the music is not just for me, it's for everyone yeah. to enjoy. Right, so I try when I'm recording or when I'm making music to put exactly the emotions I want people to feel into the music, yeah. right? It's quite hard, you know, it's quite hard. But you make it seem easy. But <laughs> that's the thing. Mm -hmm. I have to like put it in so you can feel every single emotion that I put into the music. Mm -hmm. So do you feel like you have to be face in a certain situation or come across certain challenges for you to say like feel that way and feel exactly. inspired to make exactly you know sometimes um the only way i'm able to express myself is through my music mm. right it's hard but you know we go through things every day yeah every day sometimes we don't talk about them we're True. silent about them yeah yeah but the only way i'm able to express myself because i barely i barely express myself deep yeah. Right. So, uh, you know, yeah. Are you, so would you say you're like an introvert then? Um, uh, oh. <laughs> in the middle. Um, There's a word that for it. I can't remember, but there is a word. It's some sort of like oh me because you're like introvert, extrovert at the same time, but probably yeah. depending about like around. Privacy. 
Mm. Yeah, I ask them so much. I don't like my privacy, basically. So yeah, I try as much as possible to make sure you feel every single emotion in my music. Yeah, I felt every single emotion in your music. Okay. Because it was very sweet. It's my reality though, it's real. Yeah. Like, everything that happened in that song is real. Even the conversations that happened, it's real. Wait, so you said it's real. Does that mean that whilst this conversation was actually taking place, you recorded it? Yeah, I was recording it. The thing is, <clears throat> when it happened, I was recording it with my phone, so I had to replicate wow. exactly every word that person said to me. That must have hurt as well. It hurt a lot, you know. It gave me, um, <sighs> but yeah. Aww. You're quite emotional. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. But it's good. Yeah, I mean, good. express yourself. That's the whole point. That's yeah. why we're here. Mm. It just makes me vulnerable. Mm. Uh, you know. What do you think your next project will be like? You know, being that you you're where you are now, and I mean, you're trying to grow from that experience, mm. right? Yeah, I'm trying to grow grow from the experience. I'm I'm growing mm. from the experience. I would say. And uh, my next project is going to be Chess to Life, right? <laughs> That's, why, is, why is that making me happy? <laughs> Chess to Life for my wow. It's filled with happiness and I good tell. vibes. I feel it. Me just enjoying my life and I don't share anybody. No, of course. I don't why not? Anybody, so. Yes, yeah. so I like that. Okay, so like, like what are two people? Mm -hmm. You know, you probably say, what's this? Women always talk about two people, two people, two people. <laughs> but I feel like there are people in our lives, that, you know, directly or indirectly, that like impact us. You know, even our creativity and stuff. But what two people within the music industry that has really impacted your music, like directly? Uh, so I would say the person that's impacted my writing ability that has shaped me to be a writing genius mm -hmm. i would say that is maestro sugar mm. yeah maestro has shaped me to be an amazing songwriter but someone that has shaped me to be an artist uh, to master the craft of artistry mm. is whiskey right whiskey yeah. has Done that How? Too. You know, I while growing up, I used to look up to Whiskey, right? I used to look up to Whis and um, the swag, everything. You know, mm -hmm. he gave me that mindset that you're young, you can do anything you want to do. You own mm -hmm. the world, you know. Mm -hmm. You can be whatever you want to be. Just believe and work towards it, basically. So Whis gave me that mindset, gave me that mentality, and um, I appreciate Whis for. Mm, I appreciate that. Like, no, that's wow. Like that really, like you know, I I wouldn't really have guessed. Okay. There's a song of yours yeah. that you did with Joe Boy. <sighs> <laughs> but for a minute, you know, at first, yeah, yeah, I was, I was not when you're just playing your playlist, like, and you know, like Spotify mm -hmm. refers like other tracks and mm -hmm. stuff, and then like, um, you know, you like my hair. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's cool, it's cool. Um, so, like, you know how they would refer you to like other tracks that you should listen to and mm -hmm. stuff. And I, I was like, is that Chris Daniel? Who is that? The first person that yeah. came to my brain was, who is that? Yeah. You know. And I went to check the name of the artist yeah. playing, and it was you and Joe Boy. Yeah, of course. Like, has anyone ever compared you, like your voice, your vocals? Wow. Is that something you've ever thought about? Have you ever even, you know, felt any kind of connection to Kiss? No, wow. In any way. You know, Kiss is a great artist, yeah? Yeah. But I, 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 I've never had such comparison with him before. The way I was like... You're like the first person saying it now. Wow. Yeah. I, I just haven't been for like... My ears are yeah. on a different vibe. You know, yeah. you know sometimes, um, um, you know when you're here, uh, uh, how do I explain this to you? When you hear something outstanding, something different, something amazing. Here it is. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's hard for you to just <coughs> to shake you, to shake your face. You say, wow, what is this? 
Yeah. No? Yeah. So I understand. I understand how you feel when you heard it first time. I understand. It's okay. You'll be fine. <laughs> No, honestly, I'm not even happy. Yeah. And then I heard the one you like, obviously, the one you did with Taylor Savage. Oh, it's a banger. I swear, I, no one told me. I just straight away posted it to my story. Uh-huh. It was not even Your Insta story. My Insta story. Did you tag me? Yeah, Auntie Wa. Oh wow. I don't mind this. Yeah. yeah. But you know, Instagram does something now where you don't have to, like. Like tag where you can still see and stuff like uh-huh. that. Yeah, so like they just put put on your timeline, and, and you don't have to tag, and you don't have to tag, wow. so the person can see it anyway. But I think I tagged anyway because I was like, I, this guy is amazing. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. No, that's dope, man. I can't even lie. So like, I mean, you told me how um you've been inspired, mm-hmm. you know, by Maestro. You know, you know Maestro. I think I've heard of him. I'm not gonna lie. I'm I'm very bad at lying, but no, I, I, I've heard of Maestro. I know he's good. He's amazing. He's not good. I know, yeah. He's not good. Yeah, but because I haven't. Yeah, you say he's amazing, and I believe he's, he. He's a god. He's a god. Like, yeah. I think he's produced for other people. No? Yes. Do you know this? Um, let me let me let me give you insight. The short insight. Yeah. Do you know this? Um, coronation. Still a savage coronation. Yeah, coronation. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You know, the whole instrumentation. The arrangement of how. The whole performance went was done by him. I didn't know that. Didn't know that. No. Now, I know. now I know. Wow, that's an exclusive. Oh my god. No, you know. no, but it's not even that it's an exclusive or anything. It's no. just that it's serious. It is. That is good. That is lit. I get pissed a lot of times when people with genius minds don't get enough flowers. It hurts me so much. I'm yeah. Like, but I'm like, yeah, that's how the world works. You know? and, and that's why we're on the plug. Because exactly. my, my job is to plug people in. People need to know because I usually just roll out for the underdogs, the wow. people that they have pure talent. Mm-hmm. And I'm not talking about newbies, I'm mm-hmm. talking about even people that have been sort of sidelined yeah. and not really being mentioned. Like you said, give them their flowers. Exactly. Yeah, so that's really dope. Okay, so would you say the world could do with more love? <laughs> I got you there. <laughs> I mean, I mean, you've been giving us love, son, some heartbreaks, but still love, because even the whole EP embodies the fact that the world could do with more love. So I want to know what you think. I'm not a bad boy. I'm not a bad boy. No more love. Please. No more love. So you're not going to give your heart to anyone? No, don't bad boy. Hi. Jesus. It's not my fault, man. Hi, it's my fault. I mean, are we supposed to rise above all our you know, challenges? Oh, back to back, back to back. You don't bad boy. It's not easy. Don't bad boy. So I'm a bad boy. I'm not bad boy. <laughs> but no, if I but see love, shall Yeah. So if someone loves you, you love back. It depends. Oh, you will show them your badness and see how long they can hang around for or stick to it. You no, know, I'm not going to involve in some toxic acts. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, that's... If I see real love, I, would, uh, I don't know. You might consider it. But that means that means the person has to put the work in. Exactly, you have to put the work in. You have to, you know. Impress me. Don't impress me. Just show me your genuine um, intentions. <laughs> be genuine with me. Be real with me. Basically, that's all. Don't impress me. I don't need you to impress me because I'm not gonna impress you. You know. You're not gonna. Imp- so what? You're not a romantic then. I'm romantic, but I'm not gonna impress you and want to. You know, I'm gonna let it happen naturally. Naturally, I like that. Flow, you know. Yeah, as a shit. You know. Okay, yeah. this this way you, you might get really arrested in London. Like they will not even let you go. For real? Yeah. Oof. I see handcuffs everywhere. Please <laughs> leave. You know, um, one of my favorite chats. Mm-hmm. Smile for me. Ooh. Like what inspired that? Cause I love that song so much. Like, is are you a smiley smiley person or you just want the world to smile for you? Maybe it's been so rough, like. Just tell me, tell me what what's happening because that song gets me. You know, when I wrote Bittersweet, mm. <clears throat> I wrote it with a lot of emotions, with a lot of hurt, a lot mm. of pain, a lot of anger, a lot of. Um, <sighs> <laughs> tell me, tell me. That's I'm trying to, I'm <laughs> trying to hide the. Um, some certain emotions, but um, I shouldn't. So yeah. that song reminds me a lot of my, you know, partner before. Mm. When we used to 
be together. And I told you, um, Beta Sweet is my reality. Mm -hmm. Every song, from How I Care, to mm -hmm. No Room for Love, to Near One of the End, to Tough Love, to... I love Tough Love. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. You know, to Smile For Me The Time. Every song is connected. Mm -hmm. Right? Every song is connected. Every song just reflects to one another. Like, How I Care, How I Care is me expressing to, to her, like, yo, I care for you, you know? I'm ready to ride with you. Mm. And No Room For Love, the second track, is her telling me, yo, it's no room for love. My, <laughs> My heart speaks. broken, you know? Yeah, I don't she said it's not all about love. Yeah, you yeah. know? And the third track, yeah, one at the end, I'm like, yo, let me just enjoy my life. Mm. Yeah, one at the end, you know? Yeah, yeah of course, yeah. yeah. The fourth track, Tough Love, I came back to her. And I'm like, don't show me tough love now, you know? I've received it all my life, mm. you know? I've not really been, you know? So don't show me tough love. Take care of me too. Yeah, yeah. me, you know? It's hard on me, you know? Mm. And the fifth track, Smile For Me. I'm still here with you, you know? I enjoy your smile. Your smile is what I'm I just, my day. I see your drive and your you know? fight for love, you know? That's why I was like, do you think the world could do with more love, you know? Because I'm just like, do you really crave for it? Crave for it so much, you know? But it's hard and, um, just need to keep keep on um, trying, trying mm. best. So smart for me is just me being intentional, intentional with her. I'm like yo, I enjoy your smile. Your smile brightens up my day. It makes my day it just has a way of making me just feel different, you know? As it should. You know? Yeah. I mean that's what we want. Oh, who wants? We want. We, we, we want. all want this. <laughs> do you get what I mean? We all want this. No, right? Yeah. We all need love. Yeah, we do all need you know? free love. Some of us find it hard to express mm -hmm. our love do or that we even want, want it. Hard to express love. Let's talk about you. Now. <laughs> Let's talk to you. No, but wait. With me, mm -hmm. it's either I love you mm -hmm. or I don't. I'm an in-betweener, but usually I'm more on the lovable side. I don't like to fake emotions. I think, like, you can read through me if I fake emotion inside you. I'm just honest from the get-go. Right. Yeah. Um, I feel like, obviously, what drives me are people's actions. Mm. Actions speak louder than words. So, a lot of people say so many things, but when it boils down to it, what do they really do? Mm. So that's how I process things, and I'm very like fast, like at processing where I can observe if this person has good intentions or not so good intentions. What, it? what if sometimes your observations or are you your observations are just like you over thinking things? What do you do in such cases? Do you know what? Yeah. I've actually worried about how I could misjudge people. Yeah. But in the long run, based off my experience, mm -hmm. I've always been right from the beginning. Right. So I've been hurt anyway. So it's like I give you a chance and then you hurt me. So now I've come to the point where I'm like, if it's a no, it's a no from the start and that's it. So now you have this wall built. My around. wall is yeah. up, yes. So what's gonna break that wall for you? Ha! Oh, like you said, I actions now. Be, but I, like you said, let it come naturally. Be realistic. Mm -hmm. Don't make excuses for other people. Mm -hmm. And obviously, let your just see how it goes. Basically, yeah. Like I'm not gonna make assumptions, mm -hmm. but at the same time, I'm going to, you know, watch that process. If that makes any sense, and just mm -hmm. know if this person cool or not. Because people usually show you their red flags from the beginning, but we tend to just not see it and keep thinking, oh, maybe. But then that maybe you were right from the start because when it boils down to it, and in that particular situation, they go with their natural self, which is what they're showing you from the beginning. You know, a lot of people are very, 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 um, very, very intentional sometimes. You know, let me be honest with you because. Mm. Not everybody shows you their red flag at first, you know? Yeah, you miss it. Trust me, what there are it? signs though. Mm -hmm. Even when they're faking, there's always signs that you miss it. But trust me, they are. Because I'll just tell you, just even based off a conversation mm -hmm. and how that conversation is like, like changed from the way the person's talking and then how they're talking now, and you're like, but that's not what we said. 
like but you you, you know the saying it like it never happened mm -hmm. that's a problem yeah so what i'm understanding from you is <laughs> <laughs> this conversation will switch real fast. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean you asked me a question. Yeah, I mean, sometimes yeah. you might be seeing it from a personal um experience, mm -hmm. right? So people are a lot smarter now. Mm -hmm. When they want to get what they want, sure. you know, they will strategize. That's true as well. You know, I can't very lie. Strategic. When you bring yeah. some conversations with them, they know how to answer it. Yeah. They know how to, you know. Mm. And you now you're feeling like, oh, this person might be the person. Mm. Let me bring my wall down for this person. The wall is down. Wow. Once they get what they want, bam. Also, do you know what also means? <laughs> it's gone. It's gone till <laughs> all till wow. So you know, it's just so. It's yeah. somehow, but we will survive. Have you... No. no, let's just put it this way. We're both on the streets. We're looking for love. Yeah. Yeah. I'm on the streets. I'm not sure I'm on the streets. Are you sure you're not on the streets? Oh, no. You know, define streets, though. Mm. We're on the streets, yeah. <laughs> okay. We're outside. We're outside. Yeah. Even if it's just one leg, yeah. we're still outside. Yeah. Uh -huh. With caution. Mm. <laughs> you're so <laughs> sweet. Okay. Well, I'm going to say, this is random, okay, but mm. how generous... It, or is it true that Nigerian men are generous? Because I know just a few days ago, mm -hmm. like a friend of mine said, like, you no, know, what's what's the word? Is it um devil what's it Yoruba called? Your Rajiman. Yeah, so it's like what what's going on? You know, and how mm -hmm. generous are Nigerian men truly, 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 truly? And I'm not just talking financial. Uh it depends, you know. It depends on what you are um what you have on the table for Nigerian men. See, that's the, you have to give something. Yeah, exactly. You have to rub my back, I rub yours for Nigerian men. You know, if you're not, if you're not giving anything, they can't be generous to you. You know, mm -hmm. it's just like um, if there's nothing for them to benefit from whatever is going on between you and them, mm -hmm. yeah, they can't be generous to you. It's not fair. It's, it's really not fair, you know. But then, like, what if you're generous to them from the start and then they swing away? What type of generous you're talking about? What type of generous? No, I can't really speak much on exactly. that. <laughs> but it's just, on the just generally say it. <laughs> general. Yeah. No, but I mean, you performed at Coco, like with yeah, Joe Boy, right? Mm -hmm. How was that? It was like, like your first like London performance. Yeah, it was my first London performance, and uh, it was pretty amazing because a lot of people really vibed to the record they really vibed to it so period that I, I wasn't expecting you know <laughs> please expect please <laughs> expect expect you know i always put my expectations like this very low so i don't get disappointed even in people you know but it was it was lit it was lit i loved your voice so much he's a great guy amazing soul you know I love you to meet him one day, one day, one day, one day, because he's a great guy. Yeah. And yeah, he brought me on stage. He killed it, and you guys killed it together. You I have a clip. You do? Unforgettable. Did you come to the show? Yeah, I did. Oh wow! It was so dope. It was fire, fire. Mm -hmm. Like I, I didn't come early enough to like you know mingle backstage mm -hmm. and stuff, but I came on time and I saw and I loved it. It was beautiful. Let's come my again. Let's move on. Cool. <laughs> I mean, you know, yeah. I'm not usually the only one. I think it's the traffic in London, Which one is worse? Nigerian traffic or London traffic? London traffic, London traffic is nonsense. <laughs> Why do you say that? It's learning. <laughs> it's learning from Nigerian traffic. It's learning work. It's learning work. I think it's just the, the um, I don't know how to say it, but. Is the way they slow down mm. so the traffic lights too much yeah and even all the like you can't go past 20. 20 yeah exactly so yeah i, think that's but like, I feel yeah. like they're looking for money so even if you're just like 20.1 you get you get sharp, sharp. <laughs> yeah anyway so yeah um honestly would you say like tiwa being on your track really impacted you know your yes song? yes yes um i'll say it yeah. Even the whole project, or just that song in particular? Just that song in particular. Tiwa um, blessed the record with her vocals and gave it more um, audience. Mm. Made it uh, wider. There's something about Tiwa's voice, right? Yeah. Tiwa, if I start to talk about Tiwa, I might see her for like 
forever. Because, <laughs> yeah, it's something about her. She's just amazing. Her, her connection is just... She connects to music so well. So well. Yeah. So, so well. And uh, she's somebody I love so much and I respect. She's a big sister to me. I appreciate her so much. I love her too. You love her too? Yeah, I do. Oh. I'm not going to lie. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm grateful she uh, gave the record life, more life. And um, yeah, the, the song is a hit. Yeah. A massive hit. We're gonna be, I feel like it's a song that we're gonna be hearing for days. Like even like you know like how Michael Jackson left us yeah. his old catalog, like yeah, and we still have like, like we are the world. You know, same thing with yeah. And that's what I like to do. Like that's like the music I like to make. Music that's make yeah, sense. It's just longevity. Longevity. It yeah. doesn't just fade away in a couple of um couple of months. Mm. It's still sinks in. Still brand new in your ears. Mm-hmm. Always, mm-hmm. yeah. Okay, so like, I mean, I don't know if it's because I'm a blues head or something, yeah. but like, you see how um, um, what they call it, like a cappella, your your vocals, mm-hmm. like, <laughs> oh my god, you like it? I love it. You like what you get? I I like what I am hearing. <laughs> more, more enjoy it. Ah, you speak your mom. Yes. Oh, you don't mean it. I mean it. What are you a robot, girl? Yes. Where? Are you Yoruba? No, not Yoruba. What are you? I'm Igbo. Igbo? Yeah, I'm Do you speak Yoruba? Uh, because I know some Yoruba people do speak Yoruba. Yeah, but yeah. je parle français. Ah, oui, no, no, no. No. Yoruba, no. No, okay. No. You speak French instead? Uh, be, be. Je parle français, be, be. Oui. 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 Okay. okay. So, je m'appelle Christiana. Je m'appelle Mejid. Mejid, okay. Mm. Oh, you can speak your mouth, speak your mouth for me, huh? I'm teaching myself French. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> French is good. So, I mean, are you gonna. I really kind of want to hear something in your own voice. Maybe you can sing to Christiana. Oh, you want me, you want me to sing to you? Uh, that would be 200 pounds, you know? Okay. For a VIP. Okay. You, you pay me? Yeah. You sure? You're worth it. Worth more Ooh. than that. Damn it, girl. <laughs> energy. It's the energy. <sighs> I mean, what? I mean, I can't lie. Mm. You're giving, okay? Oh, oh my God, I can stop it. <laughs> stop it. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so I mean, if we get that, you know, acapella vibes, mm. that'll be nice. Um, like even one of your tracks that you have on the on the EP was pure, no instruments, just you and just filling it out with your words. I'm just like, eesh. So I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. It's I, 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 it kind of made me want to hear what your voice would sound like, just like one on one, face to face. Yeah. Do you get what I mean? That's yeah, why that's I asked that. But it's calm. Yeah, for sure. Mm. I'm going to give you some look at the vibe afterwards. You know? Yes. I owe you, like, you owe me. Yeah, I, I owe you, kind of, though. I got you, girl. Well, you owe me because the, the guy has to give first. Ha. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> so, like, obviously, are you appro- you're not approving toxic relationships anyway, no. so that's calm. All right. So, I mean, like, it wasn't something that was supposed to take too much of your time. I'm really glad you came. I'm, I'm really glad you're here. I feel like we had a great vibe. What do you say? It's amazing. It's amazing. And, um, you know, taking my time, man. I got you. <laughs> All right. So yeah. Um. So guys, I just wanted to say that it's been an honor having Majid in the building. He's an absolute god. Period. Like I can't even say star. Like I feel all those things are, don't even come close. I mean god. Period. And yes. Um. Thank you, Majid, for coming. Thank you so much for having me on your amazing show. I appreciate you so much. So you know we have a playlist, right? Oh, yeah? Say, yeah, it's called Afro Lit Playlist. Wow. You know, it's all about the lit vibes. I hope I make the playlist. Right? You are in the playlist oh, wow. and you're on the website. Oh my god. You should check us out. I will check it out. Yeah, so and I mean if you guys want to check out this interview, the full interview, please go on www.afrolitplaylist.com and yes, you can always check our socials on the website as well and YouTube channel and the rest. Thank you, Majid. 
Thank you guys so much for um, tuning into this episode with uh, Christiana and Majid. Uh, mm -hmm. Appreciate you visit the website, follow us on Instagram. Yes, and follow uh, Majid. Majid. Follow Majid on Instagram. Plug yourself. My handle on Instagram and Twitter and um, TikTok is at Majid Official. Majid with three E's. M A J E E E D Official. On Instagram, Twitter, TikTok. And you know, Snapchat for you <clears throat> for the ladies, then you know. <laughs> so, catch up with us. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. We're out. Let's go. It's a wrap, guys. <laughs> mm -hmm.